What up, though, heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Every once in a while, I'll be wanting to counsel somebody. And when I do, I put them on the talk that talk, counsel of fame. It's not because they did some kind of egregious act or some heinous act. You know, you know what I'm talking about, man. It ain't because they did something too bad. It's just because they might have did something inside of a TV show I never liked or something. Or, you know, my wife might have said they was cute or handsome or something. Cause I'm petty like that and I still don't like Skyla for what she did to, you know, Walter White. But that ain't what I'm talking about right now. We talking about canceling somebody and you know, I, I got some new room on the council of fame. And I got to put this person up here twice. Her name is Alyssa. Alyssa. She played on, uh, we call this show married at first sight. <clears throat> I think it's married at first sight Boston. I think that's where they at right now. And she got married to this dude right here. His name, Chris. For some reason, she ain't like him, you know. Everybody not made for everybody. You know, that's her business. She, she doesn't like the dude, I guess. But I say she need to look in the mirror at herself because she got some some things with her that I just, I can't rock with, man. If she look in the mirror, the first thing she going to see is she going to see that she the Riddler because she don't know how to answer questions. She always trying to make something out, out to what it ain't. It's just she the Riddler. That's what I call her when I see her sometimes. Some, and if she look in the mirror, she might also see that she's a Karen. Because the way she was acting towards that man, like talking to the producers and talking to the production people of the show, she was making it seem like he was doing something that he wasn't doing to her. He, like, look at the way he's pointing. He's pointing aggressively. It was, she just real, man, I don't like this woman, man. And she might also see a clown if she look in the mirror. Because she think that she going to actually move inside of the apartment for two weeks. He move in. She want to hang with her girls. That's all she want to do. And, you know, live the experience. She want the experience of the show. The experience of the show is she's supposed to be getting married. Not to be hanging with no peoples. Um, I think she's just there for the cameras and, you know, want to be seen. She want the fame. Like, watching this woman on TV really makes me mad, yo. Yeah. I'm talking about every time I see her, just, oh, I can't stand her. Especially when she said she, I could have left earlier. I could have left yesterday. I think the only reason why she didn't leave is because it's cold in Boston. And she want to stay on the beach and kick back with her girls and, and live the experience. Y'all tell me, am I right? Am I wrong? Is something wrong with this person? Like, if you looked up this video, it's because y'all see the same thing I'm seeing. And this woman is hateful. And she, she ain't giving this dude a fair shake. Alyssa, Married at First Sight. Mm. Yeah, I watch Married at First Sight with my wife, too. Don't look at me like that. Anyway, we definitely going to be talking about stuff like this Friday right here on the channel. Because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. You just got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation, and holler at your boy, Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Peace. Oh, I can't stand that one.